Hey, hey everyone, how's it going today? Wazoo here with another video, and today is more of a podcasty type. So, I think um, I've got some background footage playing, and uh, that way you can just have this kind of running in a, in a tab somewhere on a cross spread out over multiple multiple monitors that you may have, uh, but I recorded some footage the other day in, in uh, World of Warcraft, so I thought I'd just put that on in the background while I talk. Yeah, so how you doing everyone? I hope everyone is kind of doing okay right now. Uh, it's about when Monday, early, or end of June here when I'm recording this, and we're currently in a, in a really big heat wave, uh, which has really kind of affected the north, northwestern and western uh, Canada and US. So it's pretty hot across the board. Um, it's going to get up to close to 40 degrees Celsius today, which is really not normal for this area. But like I say, everyone else is kind of going to be experiencing the same thing. So um, yeah, it's hot. Whatever. Um, there's definitely kind of worse things going on in the world. So, uh, but wherever you are, stay cool, drink a lot of water, stay hydrated, uh, stay out of the sun all those kind of things. Just keep as cool as you can. Anyway, I kind of wanted to talk about what I'm going to do for July. July 2021 is coming up and I thought I would really challenge myself this year and use it as a way to kind of help this channel. So I'll dig into that here. Um, about a few years ago now, well probably more than a few years ago, but I first heard or I first came across the concept of these 30-day challenges with the help of Matt, and the name escapes me now, his last name, but he was an engineer on the Google search team at the time. I don't know if he still works there. I'll uh, put I'll put a uh, comment about him in the uh, description for this video. <laughs> but uh, he came up with this concept of when I was following him at the time, he was um, really a, a promoter of the 30-day concepts. So he would do things like you know 30 days without coffee. 30 days without or 30 days of walking every day um, 30 days of you know writing a little bit of blog writing every single day to see how how he would be able to progress and see what changes would happen by the end of these 30 days and so I thought it might be a really great idea to try this out for this channel as you can see from all of the various playlists and other things that I have I kind of spread myself across many different interests and so uh, sometimes maybe the channel feels a little schizophrenic, for lack of a better word. It's not always clear. I, like I don't, you know, it's pretty obvious to anyone who comes here that I don't have a set focus, uh, a set thing for this channel. You know, like it's not like, you know, what Wazoo is known for this. Wazoo's channel is known for that, um, which they always recommend when you do any kind of Googling on how to grow your YouTube channel. Right? So... I thought I would try and solve that with this 30-day challenge. Brilliant idea, hey internet? So I'm, I've am i decided to spread myself and make a video 30 day, every day for 30 days, release a video, and we'll see what happens over the course of July. So I've kind of separated my um, strengths into various buckets. So it won't be 30 days of the same concept or 30 days of the same topic or same type of topic. It's going to be, I'm going to create a schedule, which I'll, I'll later publish, over uh, several things spread out over, over across the week, and then which will result in uh, going over the entire month. So I've come up with a few suggestions for myself based on what I'm enjoying doing on this channel. Uh, first thing is let's plays of roguelikes and indie games. So I really like roguelikes, working on roguelikes, playing roguelikes, uh, as well as just helping other indie games out there kind of get themselves, get their word out, get their, get footage of their game out across the internet. Uh, I think every little bit helps. Every game needs help in getting itself promoted, and I think there's no better. Uh, no better way of trying to help the community than just trying to promote some of these indie titles. So I think I've got that kind of category, as you can see from some of my history. Another one I've got is work on Java Spring Boot. So I'm enjoying quite a bit of Java Spring Boot, and I've got some a lot of ideas that I want to create um, some really good content for 
or you know one day down the road maybe some courses some writing who knows but for now I've got some good ideas that I think would make some interesting videos and then I've also got similarly th themed um, and ideas for a Ruby on Rails type of videos so I'm also enjoying a lot of Ruby on Rails development I think uh, between them and Java Spring Boot maybe I can combine those into one category like you know back-end development something like that but I, that's another kind of area of interest for me another one is JavaScript I use JavaScript every just about every every day of the week and so I think there's a lot I can share there with the rest of the community and really get either get themselves in into JavaScript learning JavaScript or working with JavaScript in combination of Ruby on Rails or Java Spring Boot so I'm not too sure yet if those are all the same category I mean they sound very similar like a full stack development type of category for all three or maybe I just like I say have a back-end development focus and then a front-end focus type of videos uh, and then the last one I came came into is one around game development so I've had a real passion and energy for game development ever since I got into computers I got my computer science degree to get into game development um, so I think that's always been there at the back of my head at the back of my brain whenever I start a new project I'm always keep also keeping an eye on other game development sort of topics and how how this technology I'm working with at the moment can be applied for game development that kind of thing I started a small series here called Operation Steam Dream which is getting a project up on getting my first project up on Steam and kind of all the steps involved in in executing that whole flow so I thought that would be my last kind of area of focus and this would range I could see game development ranging anywhere from uh, learning learning different language, languages and applying them to game development up into you know specifically focused tasks so things like let's make Tetris um, or other some type of retro game let's make a platformer let's make a uh, brick brick breaking game let's make an asteroids type of game so I think I've I've got things narrowed down to those four or five depending on how I break them out uh, four or five concepts and I think what I what I want to do is use use my time over July to focus on each of these and just see what happens I'm really curious uh, I'm gonna be promoting this as much as I can everywhere everywhere across my channels uh, I'm asking for any any of you out there to do the same um, I'd love a like comment and subscribe mostly a, a like and a comment a comment would really help to let me know what you're thinking what what would you like to see me focus on what are your interests uh, are you following me just for one particular thing do you enjoy the schizophrenia maybe some people out there really enjoy that uh, I'm not uh, not to say that I'll I'll never have you know products for sale of my own that I'll be that I'll be promoting but right now I don't have anything like a Patreon or um, anything like that so um, I, at the moment it's just based around what what kind of input I'm I'm able to get from any of you out there so that would be really great I'm I'm really looking forward to the month I I really enjoy creating videos editing is really neat and interested in, and I'm always kind of learning a new technique so so you might see different things showing up in my videos all the time uh, you know different effects different transitions etc 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 as I uh, pick up new techniques kind of along along the way for uh, for editing but it does take time so uh, I'm gonna have to keep that in mind and and we'll have to see you know a lot of these videos they may be I might have to take a lot of shortcuts if I'm if I'm pushing out a video a day so you know some of them might have a lot more editing done on them than others there might be a few more ums on a few of them than others and I apologize in advance so but that's up for me that's what I'm planning for this 30 days and but I throw it back to you uh, if you if you're if you've got something that you're sitting on uh, and you're wondering what to do about it for 30 days or 
in general. Maybe make it, make it a 30-day challenge for yourself. Maybe, you know, maybe you want to get into exercise or you're thinking of starting a new regime or you want to learn a language or write a book or write a blog. Uh, maybe take the next 30 days in July and go for it. Uh, leave a comment on what you decide to work on if you want to tackle anything of your own. And I'd be happy, more than happy, to promote it on this, M make a mention in a video, um, or just, you know, cheerlead, cheerlead you on Twitter, whatever, whatever your preference. But that's it for Wazoo here. So, uh, again, stay, stay cool, stay hydrated, and like and comment and subscribe, everyone. Have a great day, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.